we going to plant a tree today. <laughs> Disclaimer, I don't know what I'm doing planting a tree. My wife's the expert on this. She kind of told, told us how to do it. And I got my summer help with me today. Come here, summer help. My daughter Paige. So if you got kids, she's 11, and you don't think they can help you, put them to work. They will surprise you. All right, let's get at it. In my understanding, we need to be twice as wide as the planter and three inches below the planter. That's what we're gonna do. Y'all know what we're gonna do with that soil. We're reusing it. Oh yeah. We will be doing a live edge around this. Now, the reason why this doesn't have any grass on it because I have a low spot here. And I'm slowly filling this in. And this dirt came from up front, which y'all seen doing live edge on. All right. My wife said it need to be twice as wide. Oh, we're 12 inches. So we need to be 24 inches. That's what we need to be. I'm just marking my area where I need to be now that I know. That's 12. So we need to be 15 inches deep. And right now we are sitting at 8 inches deep. Alrighty, now we got our hole marked out. Paige, go ahead and back that up a little bit. Okay, that's good. That's good. Get a spade. This is Yep. <laughs> now this right here, this shovel's, oh, well, it's many years old. That was her great grandpa's, my wife's grandpa, who passed a couple years ago and he was. Uh, 91, 92. Now, you know me, I got a heavy duty. My wife hates using this because it's really heavy. Now, I'm going a little deeper than 15 because I'm going to put some Scott's lawn soil down in there, which has nutrients. This area right here, when we get real heavy rain, floods on me. Bringing this up and adding this in will help with that. You can put a French drain in here, but that house is going up. This house is going up. So to put a French drain in, you gotta have low side. If you don't have low side, you gotta have a pump. That adds a lot more money. I'm gonna bring this level slowly up. There's pretty much building a berm <laughs> right here building a berm from that down that way all the way down that way so that i don't have to deal with the flood somebody else will have to deal with the flood my neighbors the reason why Paige is working with me this summer we do require our kids to work she's 11 years old she can't go get a job at any place else besides working with daddy. So and daddy just has to do physical labor. So she's got to work with daddy. And earn money. Yeah. It's not child labor. It's not a uh, slave child labor. This isn't China. She's getting paid slightly above minimum wage. Okay. She is getting paid. You may be asking why am I using Scott's lawn soil and not garden soil? It's what I had. We've planted a couple trees around. One thing you gotta do is you gotta name them. A tree up front, it's called Mo. This one right here, I'll let my wife and kids come up with it. I, I don't name this, I name my tools. I do know from past experience with my wife, you wanna make sure it's level as you're doing. And when you pack the dirt in around,
sand in my glove. Gotta ask my wife a question, because I don't know. <laughs> Maybe you guys know. Put it in the comments. My wife is obviously gonna ask. Do you, once you put it in there, and put your soil in there, do you break up the soil that was around the tree? I don't know. While we're waiting for the answer, watch this little clip from me trying to fill in this area with dirt from up front. If you're gonna be serious about your lawn, you need to invest in one of these. That's my wife talking to me up there. You can't see her, but she doesn't want to be on camera. But I love her. Say, men, if you can't on camera say you love your wife, something's wrong with your marriage. back with the answer and the answer is yes the soil and everything with the pot shape that it was in you do want to break that up so that it can mix with the new stuff so we're gonna grab the hose link and we're gonna water down we got it Tree. I'm Mike, and this is Paige, the Electric Lawns family. Out! You want to go and shovel this way or this way? This way. Which way should we go shovel this? This way. Down or up? Up. Like this. Facing outward. Like. Put the face of your shovel toward me. There you go. Okay, look serious, bug. Just squint I and I know, squint and like scrunch your face up like you're mean. Okay.